Hey guys, in this video, we're going to take a look at how you can set up parental controls for your kids or child account on the Samsung Galaxy phone. First, tap on the home button to return back to the home screen. Then swipe down at the top and then tap on the settings icon. Next, we scroll down and then in here, tap on digital well-being and parental controls. After that, we scroll down to the bottom and tap on parental controls. Now tap on get started and then select child or teen. Now tap on next and then tap on add or create account for your child. Now if your child, if you haven't created an account for your child already, then you can do so. Now if you have um, family link, on your on the parents device on your device if you're the parents and you already install family link from here you can tap on add child and then you can create your child on this device once you have created the account all you have to do is just simply uh, sign in uh, on your child's account or you can create an account here if you wanted to so here put in the email or phone number and tap on next and then we put in the password now put in the account password and then tap on next and here say choose a parent so here i'm going to choose um, myself as a parent and then put in the password so put in the password and tap on next once you verify your account tap on i agreed and then tap on next then tap on next and said here getting things ready so this time make, may take a few minutes. Now tap on next. Then tap on allow. Next in here, review apps. These apps come with this device. You can remove the ones you don't want Jan to you. So you can select which one your child can use or can't use. So here we go down the list and simply uh, remove any apps that you want to block them from using. For example, TikTok, uh, Spotify, you can remove it. And then scroll down and tap on next. As it said here, set up YouTube. You'll be able to choose which YouTube apps your child can use and what types of content they can access. So tap on next, then tap on OK. Here you can choose YouTube Kids, uh, YouTube and YouTube Music. And here tap on select. And it says choose a content setting for your child. So explore generally aligns with content ratings for viewers 9 plus. Explore more or most of YouTube. And then tap on select. Then tap on next. Then tap on more and then tap on finish setup. So there will be a lot of steps to go through. Then tap on let's go. And here we've got parental controls. Uh, and here you can set daily limit, screen time daily limit, downtime. Uh, you can view block apps, supervision, or oh, sorry, supervision, signing devices, location sharing. Uh, that can be turned on or off, location settings your settings so if you want you can tap on location sharing to turn it on and that's it now you can tap on the back key to get out of it now here if i go back in we've got um, parental controls at the top and then we've got supervision and if you tap on the, this button here and if you tap on stop super, uh, supervision then it says go to remove account. So Google accounts for children must be supervised to stop parental supervision. Uh, on this device, you need to remove your child's account. So if you tap on it, it will go to this page here where you can uh, remove the account, but we'll ask you to uh, sign into your account. And here, if we go to the parent's device, on the parent's device, we can go into settings. Then go down and tap on digital well-being and parental controls. Scroll all the way down, then tap on parental controls. 
And here in the menu, you want to select the child account. So here we've got Jan, that's the account. And we can view location, we can controls, and we can view highlights. So tap on controls. In here, you can choose content restrictions. Tap on that will allow you to control the content for YouTube, uh, Google uh, apps and services, plus any other apps that you install on your device. So here, if I install uh, more apps, then it will appear in the list here. So here, if we go into controls uh, on this uh, chain device, on the child's device, you can set a daily limit. You can set downtime app limit, set time limits, and block apps for your child. So in here, uh, we've got CapCut, ConMaster, for example, game. So here you can choose uh, always allow, set limit, or block. And so here, Jane won't be able to use ConMaster or see other app on her device. So tap on done. And here if I go into this device, so if I try to play that game or look, search for that game, it won't be able to uh, find it. So here if I choose set limit, and we set it for 30 minutes a day. Then she should be able to use this uh, game here. We've got ConMaster, and we can play that game for 30 minutes uh, daily. So you can choose always allowed, or set a time uh, limit. And next, if we go back in here, we've got content restrictions. So you can change the content restriction. And we've got account settings. You can change the account. Uh, info controls uh, signing in process, controls your third uh, controls for third parties apps in here. And it's a manage third party apps access. And here, Google account sign-in prompts. And so you're managing controls for Jen's IT Jungle's account. And that's it. So we go back, location settings. You can activate location settings or location sharing on uh, your child's device. So if, so if you tap on location settings in here, you can turn it on or uh, switch it off. And tapping on highlight settings will give you a summary of your child's activity and usage. So, so here, also ask your child to change the settings, highlight from Google Apps. And that's it. So if I tap on highlights, it will give me at the top here, you will have a map of your child's location or your kid's location. And at the bottom here, you'll be able to view some information. So in highlights, it gives you a highlights or a summary of your child's activity. And here it says recently install stop multitasking, stop multitasking during homework and some uh, information that you can uh, read on how to use your parental uh, control. And that's it. So it's very extensive and it will um, give you a full total control of your child's account uh, via family link. And that's it. Thank you for watching this video. Please like and subscribe to my channel for more videos.